And I'm Casey Cronus live on the near west side where another group of migrants from the southern border has just arrived. Take a look. Suitcases and personal belongings were set aside outside while migrants were checked in in the building. In the midst of a measles outbreak, the city is now requiring all new arrivals to have the MMR vaccine, a shot that is being administered here. Officials say migrants who show up at the landing zone without proof of prior vaccination and who refuse the vaccine will no longer be placed into shelter. And speaking of shelters, evictions continue to loom for those whose 60 day limit is up. Earlier today, a group of council members spoke out against the mayor's eviction policy and say despite attempts to get clear answers, there is still much confusion over the policy. In the past several days, we have tried to get answers on how eviction decisions are being made so we can share them with new arrivals who are scared that they will lose the roof over their heads and have to pull their children out of school. But the reality is that we have restraints. We just do. We've always had them. I've said this from the very beginning, that this mission is unsustainable. Local municipalities are not designed to deal with an international global crisis, particularly as it relates to migrants and asylum seekers. City officials say a total of four buses are expected in the area from Texas today. About those evictions, 34 people were expected to be evicted over the weekend, but many of them were granted extensions again, and only three were evicted from their shelters on Sunday. Reporting live on the near west side, Casey Cronus, Fox 32, Chicago.